Hi, my name is Nina. I am a Toltec Shaman and Crystal Healer, and I'm from Crystal Sun Healing. And this week, we're going to do the video on Wolfenite. So this is Wolfenite. I picked this up in Mexico. A nice, cute little mining town in Mexico. And so, a little bit about Wolfenite. This is actually very toxic, and after I'm done working with it, I'm gonna wash my hands. With that being said, you don't wanna keep it in your pocket and you don't wanna wear it on yourself. You want to use it in a crystal grid. Otherwise, the chakras that it aligns with the most are the root chakra and the sacral chakra and the solar plexus. So this really uh, strengthens all of your lower three. Its element is fire. The zodiac sign that may resonate the most with it is Sagittarius. Uh, the planets, I feel, are Venus and Mars, and its energy is very masculine. So with this stone, when working with the stone, it's great for new beginnings, any kind of creativity, manifestation, any kind of alchemical process that you're going about, uh, deep transformation. When you're using it in healing journeys and meditation, it's really good for healing past life relationships and issues and all kinds of like soul recognition. Uh, it, it brings balance to the body. So in healing, it's really good for uh, balancing out the hormonal imbalances, including PMS or any kind of like menstrual or um, menopausal type stuff. Uh, it's also good for emotional balance. So once again, that Venus, Mars, uh, feminine, masculine balancing so when you bring these things into balance and you bring them together, once again, you have that manifestation quality. Um, it allows you to really, working with this mineral really allows you to help create your own reality. And it allows you to gain awareness and clearing your own self-sabotage and self-defeating attitudes. This is a great stone for innovation, bringing ideas, and just really helps to fortify your mental processes in your mind. And it, just like uh, pyromor pyromorphite, it connects your desire with your will. So if you want to work with these two together, I highly recommend it. They even look kind of similar, but they're not. This one is like more cuby. There's more cubes in there, and this one is like more bulbous or morphic, as you can see. So. Um, if you want to know more about pyromorphite, uh, excuse my, excuse me, pyromorphite, if you would like to know more about pyromorphite, check one of my more recent videos. I just put it out and it will be in my playlist. Otherwise, if you like this video, please like, share, comment below. Check me out on my website, crystalsunhealing.com. I'm also on Facebook, Crystal Sun Healing. I'm on Instagram, crystal underscore sun underscore yogi. And um, send me a message, connect with me. And I, I love to interact with people. And um, if you have any suggestions for any crystals you would like to learn more about or any special videos that you would like me to focus on, I've been doing uh, a gridding live special. Uh, you can go back, it's like a journey through the chakras. And let's see what else unfolds from that. Otherwise, I offer readings and energy clearings and consultations that you can find on my website. I'd love to hear from you and I'll see you next time.